we want to simplify the given expression using the order of operations. So notice the first step is to simplify inside the parentheses, but in this case, there's nothing to simplify inside the parentheses, so we go to step two, we want to simplify the exponents. So looking at this part of the expression, we do need to be careful. This is negative and then positive three-sevenths squared, or it might be helpful to think of this as the opposite of three-sevenths squared. Since this negative sign is not inside the parentheses, it's not being squared, and therefore when we expand this, it will be negative. This would be the opposite of three-sevenths times three-sevenths, and then we'd have plus, I'm gonna go ahead and write three as three over one times one-seventh. Notice once we expand this, we really just have two products and a sum, which takes us to step three. We need to multiply and divide as it occurs from left to right. So looking at this product here, notice there are no common factors between the numerators and denominators, so it's not going to simplify, so we can go ahead and multiply. This will be the opposite or negative, and then three times three is nine, and seven times seven is forty-nine. Plus, here nothing simplifies, so we'll have three sevenths. Now the last step is to add these fractions, but we do have to have a common denominator. So with a denominator of forty-nine and seven, we want the smallest number that is divisible by both forty-nine and seven, which would also be the least common multiple of forty-nine and seven, and that would be forty-nine. So we can obtain the least common denominator if we multiply this denominator by seven and the numerator by seven. And now, since this fraction is negative, I'm gonna go ahead and move the negative sign up into the numerator. This is often helpful when adding and subtracting sign fractions. So we'll have negative nine forty-ninths plus, this will be twenty-one forty-ninths. So now that we have a common denominator, denominator stays the same, and we add the numerators. So negative nine plus twenty-one is gonna be positive twelve. So all of this simplifies to twelve forty-ninths.